All right, guys, we'll go into question four defense by Quincy Roche. Please raise your hand for the microphone. Um, what was it ultimately about Miami that kind of made you want to come here? What did Derek King's um, decision have any factor in that? Um, obviously, you know, thank you for the question. Obviously, it's a um, great, great, great history to the program. Um, I thought it was a lot of great guys in the program. It's a great culture here. Um, and the defense was high intensity, high energy defense, um, similar to what we did at Temple. And I just thought it would be a great fit for me. I, I guess you've had a chance to meet some of your teammates. I'm Manny Navarro from The Athletic, by the way, Quincy. Nice to meet you. Um, I guess you've had a chance to meet a lot of your, your teammates so far. Have you had a conversation with, with Greg Rousseau? And I know he's a competitive guy, and, and so are a lot of the other guys on that defensive line. Is there already talk about who's going to have the most sacks this year? Is there kind of a fun maybe banter between you guys already? Um, well, I mean, obviously it, it helps to have somebody as talented as him, um, to be playing with somebody as talented as him. So I just look forward to the opportunity of um, learning from him. Um, we can learn something from each other, and hopefully we can make each other better. Hey, Quincy. Uh, David Fronis, Sun Sentinel. Uh, what do you like about Manny Diaz's defense, uh, his coaching style, and uh, just anything else you like about the university when you came here, and uh, et cetera? Well, I like the fact this is aggressive defense, aggressive style defense. I mean, there's a lot of talent around, um, a very talented D-line. And like I said, I'll, I'll, I think that it could only make each one of us better. Um, and I'm just excited. I'm looking forward to the opportunity to um, go out there and play with these guys and display our talent. You're going to get a chance to play against your former team the first game of the season. Was that something that maybe like, maybe like, was it like more of a hesitation to come to Miami because of that? Or was that like more, did it all factor in the reason why you wanted to come to Miami to get a chance to kind of play against your team? I'm sure there's no animosity there or anything, but it's a unique opportunity. Um, it definitely is a unique situation. Um, I'm thankful for the opportunity I had. Um, I wouldn't, I wouldn't trade. Um, I wouldn't, rep I wouldn't do it, do it. If I had to do it all over again, I'd do the same thing. Um, not a bad relationship at the school. Um, I wish everybody there the best, but you know I'm a Miami Hurricane now, and I'm just trying to uh, maximize this opportunity and do the best I can here. I guess as a pass rusher, you know obviously you've had a lot of success already, but I'm wondering what parts of your game, you know, you want to try to focus on to improve here in your in your last year, and, and what do you, what does Coach Stroud and Coach Diaz talk to you about as, as far as how they think they can help you? Consistent. Um, consistency is a big thing. I'm being um, obviously still still being um, dominant in the pass rush game while still being dominant in the run game. I'm making plays in space. Just being an overall uh, complete player and keeping keeping consistency every day in and day out. Hey Quincy, uh, David Olson from the Miami Herald. Uh, after the year you had last year, I'm sure you could have thought about going to the NFL. Um, probably would have gotten drafted. Uh, what what kind of made you want to go this transfer route and you know come come to a school like Miami and, and develop for this last season? Um, just just being honest with myself, I thought I had a lot more development as a player, um, and I thought that this would be the right place to do it. Um, I thought I could. I, the, the great it's a, it's a lot of good pieces. Um, the, the defense is. I thought I was a great fit for the defense, so I think I'd be I'll be able to develop and become a better player being here. It is National Signing Day, so what are your, some, you know, some of your early impressions for some of the early enrollees at the defensive end position, the pass rush position? Um, you know, just I'm j just come in ready to work. You know, um, everybody here is talented. Um, everybody here has, has a high work ethic. So just come in ready to work and, you know, day in and day out, and let's make the best out of this opportunity. Last question. Um, have you seen... A uh, Derek King in action. Yes. Yeah. Yeah. We played against each other. So what was that? We played against each other. Can you tell me your impressions? Um, one of the most dynamic players I ever played against. Um, his ability to run the ball, second to none. Um, 
while he's, he can still run, he can still throw the ball. So he's he's really a dynamic player. Um, I'm excited to play. I'm kind of happy that I don't have to play against him. <laughs> and so I'm just excited. Um, I think he'll do. I, I think he'll do great things on the offensive side of the ball, and you know, as as on the defensive side, and we're just trying to bring that same, uh, do, do the same thing, and keep the same intensity that we had in the years past. Thank you so much. Yes. Thank you. Very much. Thank you.